Suppose that seventeen fifty dollars American, maybe Canadian, was deposited into an account that offers a 0.78% annual interest rate compounded continuously. Oh, that one makes much more sense. How much is in the account after 15 years? All right. We use the formula A equals PE to the RT. Uh, letters mean the exact same thing, except remember E is not a variable. It is the number E the exponential number 2.71828 approximately. Uh, also be careful, R is point, 0 0.0078. Just as before, you have to move that two places to the left to go from a percent to a decimal. And T is 15. Putting this in the calculator. E to the X is above natural log there. We get 1967.21 if we round to two places. Excellent. How long will it take for the account to reach $2,500? Well, that means we want $2,500 in the future. We are starting with $1,750 now. Interest rate is still the same. But by asking how long will it take, we don't know t, the amount of years. So once again, this is an exponential equation. Uh, it's not one to one because we don't have e on both sides as a base. So we have to get rid of that 1750 by dividing both sides. Because remember, your coefficient of the exponential term has to be a one. And let's check to see if this is an ugly decimal. I'm guessing it is, but who knows? It is an ugly decimal. So do not write that decimal because it's an approximation. Convert that to a fraction. We get 10 sevenths. That's a much better fraction. All right. Our t is in the exponent as stated. We need to solve for it. So we need to turn this exponential equation to a logarithmic. Because there's an e involved, what type of log do you need? You need a natural log. None of those artificial ones. And then to finish off, divide by that decimal to get t's value. So we'll say the natural log of 10 sevenths divided by all that good stuff. There we go. So when t is approximately 45 point, we'll go to one place, seven years. We knew that our answer is bigger than 15 because after 15 years, um, it grew to 1967. Um, and we want to get to 2,500. So our answer makes sense. Um, but, you know, 45 years is still a stretch from 15 years.